We've got four different working parties going on just now, all leading different aspects of the challenge. And the leaders within that range from a principal teacher to a newly qualified teacher and an early learning and childcare practitioner. My role as literacy champion is to develop the curriculum to ensure that all the children are attaining to make sure that all the staff are actively involved in the changes. As, as my role as an university champion, it was really important that I supported um, the staff to become leaders themselves and try and build capacity within the school. But it's really the people that are the important part of the attainment challenge. We do have a staff who feel empowered. There are lots of opportunities for our staff to take the lead. Um, and I joined the Numeracy Working Party. I, I just feel like I've really improved my skill set. We've been able to use Higgies 4 to be able to benchmark our own performance, particularly with the leadership section. All the staff were involved in that, but it's, it's distributed equally amongst the staff. So I had opportunities to share it with the children as they've led their own learning, particularly round about our literacy work this year. And there's been a substantial amount of work done with our literacy group voice is really heard in our school and we value the opinions of our children and we use those opinions and their judgments to feed into what we teach. We all have to work together as a team. I'm an improvement scientist and we learned how a little change can make a big difference. And a lot of the work we do through the Attainment Challenge is about parental engagement and giving our parents within our community the capacity to support. So learning through play since primary one into primary two, there's loads of difference in our achievement. More confident in mathematics, spelling, things about money, the financial side, she's getting to grips with that. 